Let's talk about um, uh, what entrepreneurs need to know. The biggest thing entrepreneurs need to do is adjust their mindset. I think knowledge you can always pick up. Yeah. They just don't, they don't see themselves as entrepreneurs. They don't believe in their vision enough. We're just talking about here, like they're looking for the no's, they're looking for all the reason why it's not gonna work out. Right. If you're focusing on the tactics, you're gonna lose. Yeah. If you're, fo if you're making a YouTube channel and all you focus on is what camera you're gonna use, you've lost. Yeah. So it's stepping above to say, I'm capable of amazing things. I'm gonna go off and create it. Yeah. Whatever challenge comes in my way, I'm yeah. gonna solve it. And you and I were talking today. Resourcefulness. You know, yes, resourcefulness. Resourcefulness. Yeah. And some people would say resourcefulness, but in Toronto, it's with a Z. The spelling is resourceful. Resourcefulness. It's, it's different. Well, and you know what? And you do. You have a systematic way of organizing things. And you, we were talking earlier about about my channel, and you've, yeah. you've said some very some very nice things He's about got my a great channel. channel too. Um, kind of, but you, you you've talked. You've helped me identify a core issue in okay. my problem, yeah. in my channel. Talk about that that philosophy uh, for a YouTube creator, even a business owner, yeah. and, and how they need to have that one thing. For you to have success, it can't just be about knowledge transfer, it has to be about energy transfer. When I watch your videos, I need to feel something. Yeah. I need to feel something. Right. The best videos, when you watch them, you feel something. Whether you cry, or you laugh, or you're happy, you're motivated, you're energized, you're excited, you need to feel something. So for Owen, the main thing that he wants to get out is freedom. Like he, want, he wants to feel freedom in the work that he does, yeah. and he wants people to feel freedom when they watch his content. Yeah. And so when he feels boxed in, having to be corporate, and having to do boring things and just do a top five list and not have his funny wild side, oh, and video, ah! you know, slamming out, then he's he feels boxed in. But that's how he's gonna win. Like, I like watching this guy's videos, this is great advice, but I like what I just like seeing what Owen's gonna do. Like, I, I feel he gives me permission to be more free because right. he's being free, right? And so that's the key thing, and, and any, any, any value is fine, but when you feel stifled in your ability to create a, a video, a piece of content, a service that is authentically you, yeah. you always will lose. Right. If you're trying to be the data analytics guy and that's not who you are, you lose. Yeah. And so when you identify the value that you stand for the most, and then you bring that to every piece of product, of content, of, of interview, of everything you're doing, that's when you start to win because nobody can replicate this. Right, right. right. Now, so how do we determine those values? How do we find those values? You'd asked me a couple questions and, and just got me in, to where I said it was freedom. Uh, you know, how do we help that person who's watching this channel and going, okay, well, I, how do I discover that one thing? So think about all of the things that you've loved in your life. Like, who's your favorite teacher and why? Yeah. It's not because Mrs. Clark taught you grade five math. Right. Like, there's one teacher who stood out what was it about them yeah. that you really liked? What's the favorite thing you learned from your parents? What's your favorite movie and why? Who's your favorite artist that you oh like listening to and why? Like, why did why did you why does he have oh and video like screaming on, on the front of his like you almost toned down the intro to match the yeah. content instead of bringing up the content to match the intro. And right? you know you know my favorite movie? Yeah, Shawshank Redemption. Do you know that movie? Yeah, freedom it's all about freedom. Freedom, dude. Dude. <laughs> It's a lifelong thing. It's always been there. Yeah. And it's and if you recognize it, then it will only grow stronger. It's yeah. like it's it's forever. Owen at, at, at 65 is still gonna care about freedom. Yeah. It's Probably more away. so because it's likely yeah. I'll be arrested soon. Yeah, but yeah. So. But but as you as you now understand it and you double down on it, it's only gonna grow more and more strong. Yes. Or yes. you will refuse to be leashed and boxed in and be yeah. told what to do and have to succumb for some corporate client or because of how somebody might perceive you. Right. Like you only grow badder and bolder. Like he's coming in full on neon pants next year. Like it's happening. This is this is pretty you know he's rocking a two body, I love it, but you know that's it, changing next year. If it makes you it's feel coming. better, I've been wearing the same pants for like four days. Right? And in a way, that's very liberating. That, I feel free, it, you know? It, Commando. It's a small way, way, but now, now he's pulling it up. So, right? <laughs> so, so the other thing then, like yeah. if you can't get it going positive, you, you go negative. Okay. Who are the people that you can't stand being around? Right. And they're not bad people. Who are the people you can't stand being around? Yeah. And, and again, they're, they're great people. We're not judging them as humans, but like the, the way they are yeah. just is toxic to you. Yes. And have always been. Yeah. So Aunt Susan or the professor that you hate right. or somebody at work. Yes. Right? Because for you, it'd be like they're restricting your stifling. Right, stifling. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. yeah. You and so you, you go the opposite of that. So you kind of find out. Right. So if you can, some people have an easier time going negative. So think right. about all the, the negative people you hate and why. Like, what's the thing that you hate about them? 
that's common, and then you go the opposite. And that's what you stand for. Right? Yeah, that's massive. Yeah. So when you figure that out, then then everything changes. It does. It falls into place. And you know, I what I've been struggling with, and maybe you guys can relate, is you know trying to find the content that my channel is all about, right? Like, do, am I doing how-to stuff, or am I doing camera reviews, stuff that I really don't enjoy, and I really don't enjoy it. And I think that you know, Andrew, you said it. You, you said, hey, I can see in your face that you, you broke don't the fourth wall. You just broke I the fourth wall. My own you broke rules. It. Hey, there's no rules, right? right? I'm free. Right. I'm free, baby. <laughs> uh, uh, you know, there's this there's this thing that that says I can do what I want as long as it's couched in what I love to do, which is freedom. And I think so for you guys that are, I think you're going to see different, you're going to see new it's content coming. on my, yeah, exactly. You know, we're, we've got wigs and costumes and all sorts of fun stuff is going to come on the, I think, the channel. I think different color goatee beards. Yes. It seemed like. Fire. Yeah, fire on the, the fire yeah. beard. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. It's totally no, it's coming. coming. It's coming. coming. <laughs> Maybe a neck tattoo is in nice, the, you dude, know, I like it. You got the, you got the, you're showing off the arm. Uh, yeah, exactly. Nothing says, you know, I don't belong in corporate America quite like a right? neck there tattoo. You, go, you right? know what I mean? Uh, but don't, if don't you give guys, me the LeBron James like uh, sleeve. Don't cover up my, right? That's right. Right. That's right. I don't need it. Right. Right. Not on this channel, folks. Not in life. Not being around Owen. I'm yeah. already feeling more free too now. Oh, uh, yeah. It's, and it's basically because we interrupted him, you know, to be, to be, so he's, he's allowing us that free. Freedom. But if you're in a place where you're struggling with your channel, you don't know what to do next, I want you to think about what you heard here today and are you living true to that principle, that core value in your channel? I know that I wasn't. And so, you know, be be free from that. Accept that maybe you might, might be walking in that. Use the tactics we talked about here to discover that core value and move forward making content that's true to you. I like how you said be free to from that. It is. Be free. I need to be free from this shirt. Right? Yeah. There you go. It'll come. It'll come later on, guys, so be sure to subscribe. Evan, thanks so much for your time here today. Always. Having a blast talking to you. All right, guys, we'll see you in the next video.